Hey everyone, it's Meg here with Marigold Holistic Pet Care. And in this video, we're gonna talk about Bandit. He is a, an adoptable dog from the Huntington County Humane Society. We are here in the absolutely beautiful Croft Creek State Park. And um, we have had a heck of a fun time um, hiking the trails here. They have Rainbow Falls. They also have Balanced Rock here. And just a lot of really cool rock formations here at Trough Creek State Park. And it's been really fun. But um, talking about Bandit, he has been an awesome pal. He just wants to go, go, go. He he uh, forges ahead. He's ready to go. He doesn't seem to be scared about much. But um, we've had a really good time. And I double leashed him as well. I like to double leash dogs whenever I take them out that don't know me. And I don't know them. And we're on the trail and things get crazy. So um, I like to have control with double leashing dogs on hikes that I take uh, that you know I'm not particularly familiar with. But um, he's been amazing. I, I tell you what, you know, having dogs at the shelter, people think that there's something wrong with them. And typically what happens is when you have animals at the shelter, it's not always the, the animal's issue. It's typically an issue within maybe um, the human, okay? So, uh, you know, if a, a dog like Bandit, I mean, he's absolutely incredible. He's been super friendly with everybody he's met. He um, has, has done awesome on the trail. He's had a really good time. And, um, but, you know, just somebody, you know, maybe didn't realize how much it is to, to take care of a dog or what their needs are or even financially, not just logistically. But, um, and, uh, you know, so dogs like him, he, he's just a really great all-around dog. I mean, I've not had a problem with him. I'd love to take him home. Uh, so next time, you know, you're considering adding an animal to your, your home and your family, maybe consider a, a shelter and don't think that there's something wrong with the animal, which is why they're at the shelter. That's not typically the case. And, and in this case, I mean, I think Bandit was, has, you know, would make a really great addition to a family. And, um, you know, if, you, if you're unsure of adding a pet to your family, uh, volunteer. You kind of get your fill, but without the responsibility. And you can also test drive things. You know, you take a dog for a hike as a volunteer. And, you know, if you really vibe with a dog and, and you're looking for one, then you can say, all right, you know, this might be a really good match. Um, if I was looking for a dog, I definitely would. Um, I've been vibing with Bandit here. He's been a lot of fun, huh, buddy? Yeah, I don't, I don't think he really wants to, to sit still much longer. Are you ready to go? Yeah, you ready to go on the hike a little bit more? Yeah, we gotta take a break because you're, you're, you're dark. You got some dark fur. We're gonna keep you cool in the water, huh? Yeah, so volunteer at your shelter, spay your pets, and pick up dog poop when you're on the trail.
Are you got nobody wants to see your butt. Nobody wants to see your butt. Yes. Nobody wants to see your butt. You silly boy. You're a silly boy. What are you thinking? What are you thinking? Excuse me, sir, can I help you? <laughs> You're funny. <laughs> are you gonna sit on my lap? Okay. Oi. There. Is that good? Is that good? Are we having fun? Is this good? Huh? Tell everybody, say, adopt me. Adopt my friends. I'm a good boy and I'm handsome. Oh, you're sweet. You're a sweet boy. What, are you ready to go? You don't like sitting still and doing um, videos. <laughs> Silly boy. All right, let's go. Now I'm a mess. And just another reminder, please pick up your dog poop on the trail.